Well, boys and girls, it looks like it's over. It's finally over. The EU, whoever they are, I'm American. I don't know what EU is. Anyway, the EU is saying, be ready to lose all your money in crypto. This is all from the EU regulators. Anyway, regulators are increasingly worried that more consumers are buying 17,000 different crypto assets, including Bitcoin and Ether. Rock, bro, that's bad. You can't do that. Anyway, the EU, the EU, I don't know, ah, stupid man. The EU has warned consumers cannot seek compensation under existing financial services law. Well, who gives a crap? What is it your business? What other people buy? I mean, I know you want to control the world, the authoritarians, all that bull crap. But let consumers buy what they can buy. You know, none of this nanny state stuff. Anyway, uh, consumers risk losing all their money invested in crypto assets and could fall prey to scams. Oh, no, we need a nanny society. We need them to hold our hands. Oh, again, it's the elite that run these things. They don't think the common man has the intelligence or the responsibility to buy what they want, to invest what they want. And they don't want you getting wealthy. They're getting a little nervous there because they can't control this crypto world. They want to regulate it to death, but yeah, that's probably the best they're going to do. Oh boy, let's see. They could fall prey to scram scrams. The European Union Securities Banking and Insurance Watchdogs. Who are these clowns? These are people that went to school and didn't learn anything and got a job doing nothing. That's what this is. Sounds like a cushy government job. Uh, they all said in a joint statement, probably was smoking joints. On Thursday, Thursday, today's Tuesday. Oh, well, consumers face consumers we, losing my voice. Consumers face the very real possibility of losing all their invested money if they buy these assets. The three EU authorities said in a statement, Ooh, how can how convenient? What a coincidence, man. Anytime the government tells me not to do something, there's probably a good reason to do it. Oh, my God. All right. It marks a ratcheting up of a of direct warnings to consumers about crypto assets by EU authorities, spelling out that consumers have no protection or recourse to compensation under existing EU financial services law. Well, let, let, me, uh, let me give you a little wake-up call. Say the bank lost all your money, and they're under all this financial services law BS. You're not going to get your money back anyway. Those banks aren't going to help you. They don't care. This is all crap. They're scared of crypto. They're scared of the common man getting wealthy. Uh, right now, it looks bleak, obviously. It's just another correction. It's a four-year cycle. Come on. So come back in 2024, 20, 25, the market will be back up, right? I don't know, man. This is crazy. Crazy. Again, the people that don't make anything are in government, and they try to regulate those that are entrepreneurs and are successful people trying to get ahead in life. They want to bring you down, buckets in a crab, buckets in a crab, crabs in a bucket, where they're pulling you back down to the level of mediocrity that they're used to. You know, they're uh, what, what is a government worker? Cradle to grave. They just get in there at 18 right out of high school, and then they're just waiting for the body bag to drag them out of the government facility where they've done their 30 years of service and got their little $5 pin and uh, attaboy, and uh, you got every day off every month for every conceivable holiday for every everything. Uh, yeah, if you don't want to work, join the government. Federal government is white-collar welfare. Trust me, I know. <laughs> All right. I'm so glad these regulators are increasingly worried that more consumers are buying all these assets. Oh, they're afraid of Bitcoin. They're afraid of Ether. Yeah, they account for 60% of the market without being fully aware of the risks. Regular set. Man, banks are risky too, man. It's all fake money. They're just printing money like no tomorrow. Give me a break, guys. Again, when governments and news agencies say don't do something, you do the opposite. Trust me. Consumers should be alert to the risk of misleading advertisements, including via social media and influencers. Uh, duh. I mean, that's why you have critical thinking skills. Do your own research. If you just go out and listen to some idiot on YouTube or some ad you see, you're stupid. Yeah. Again, they don't trust you. They're trying to nanny state you. That's what's going on here. Anyway, consumers should be particularly wary of uh, promise fast or high returns, especially those that look too good to be true. Yeah, duh. Meanwhile, consumers should be aware of that energy consumption for producing some crypto assets is high and that the environmental impact has, uh, the statement says. 
So here now they're trying to bring out this uh, BS environmental crap. Yeah, it's all silly. Is that it? All right, more uh, more FUD, more of the uh, authoritarian governments coming out, warning us, warning us, the people that earn the money and pay taxes, that us, the we, the consumers, about the risk of losing our money when they're taxing us to death by stealing our money uh, through taxation. So pretty funny, isn't it? And these are people that are your neighbors. If you have a guy that is in your neighborhood, works with one of these places, just go shame them. Go shame on you. Shame on you for the crappy, worthless job you hold taking my money through taxes and trying to warn me about investing money and stuff I believe in that may make me money down the road. And if I doesn't make me money, well, that's my my fault. That's my risk. That's my reward. I don't need you telling me what to do. Oh, my God. The warning was issued by its securities, banking, and insurance watchdogs. I want names. I want names. I want names. Who are these people hiding behind these things? You know? It's, it's such crap, man. The, EU, the EU has also warned of the environmental impact of crypto assets. Oh, the EU. Well, listen here, EU. You guys have nothing but wars in the past 100 years. That environmental impact was pretty bad. So I don't think you guys have a place to talk. Jeez, man. Have you been to Europe? Have you been to Paris? What a crapple. It's like the Baltimore of Europe. It's, a, it's such a dump. Oh, my God. Talk about pollution. Oh, my God. All right. That's all I got. I just get mad when I read this FUD. They're going to lose all your money. The regulators are warning you. Well, you know what, guys? Stop taxing me and give me some of that money back. You know, anyway, I'm out. Just a rant. Talk to y'all later. Get mad. Get angry. Get in the streets and say, I'm tired and sick of it. I'm not taking it anymore. Anyway, buy what you want. It's your money, not financial advice. Do your own research. Do not listen to any article or any idiot on YouTube. It's your money. Use your brain. If anything, put it in a pillow. That might be the best place for it. I don't know. I doubt it, but who knows? That's all I got.